All right, we're here with Cole Landman, Shenandoah. Just won to uh, make the semis. Talk a little bit about uh, your quarterfinal match. Well, a lot of the guys from my team lost in the quarterfinals, so I felt like it was on me to uh, carry our team through the rest of the tournament. So it was a lot of pressure, and I just wanted to make everyone proud, so I tried the best I could, wrestle it like it was my last match. Uh, you had a takedown pretty early and I think had three or four minutes of riding time. Did you know much about your opponent coming in? Um, I knew he was a big, strong kid. I know he's going to uh, Buck now, so he, uh, he's obviously a good wrestler. But I just came out of my guy. I try to approach every match. So he's going to Bucknell and in, uh, in the EIWA. You'll be in the EIWA as well. Uh, talk about your decision to go to Princeton. Um, well, I've been thinking about Ivy for uh, since I've been thinking about college. And I knew uh, the uh, powerhouse Ivy schools like Cornell. <laughs> so I looked in there and uh, I think I really found a good fit with Princeton, the coaches and the team, they're all great guys. Great. Um, last weekend, um, I think it was, was the uh, New York, New Jersey Charity Classic, which you uh, participated in. Uh, came down to the last match and uh, came down to you basically at heavyweight to determine who would win. Uh, what was that like going in? Well, I was kind of hoping it wouldn't <laughs> come down to me, uh, so there was less pressure, but I think with the uh, crowd and my team really cheering me on to win, I think it helped me, propelled me. So you went into, um, into overtime, correct? Yep. Um, and I, I heard that your opponent was a pretty big heavyweight, but you were able to ride him out. It's, just talk a little bit about that uh, yeah. overtime. Well, we, had, we did a uh, matchup before the duel even started. We were supposed to be like facing each other, looking at each other. And he's a good three or four inches taller than me, so I'm looking up like that. So I got a little nervous about that. But once I started wrestling, I felt him out. I knew what I had to do. What was it like to participate in that event? I mean, for charity and a big crowd. Oh, it was great. Um, two great charities. I think we raised a lot of money for, and it's just great to uh, have wrestling in that kind of uh, atmosphere beyond TV. It was on uh, MSG Varsity, so hopefully more stuff like that will happen in the future. Are you uh, going to take some time off after this, or continue wrestling this summer? Um, I'm going to be practicing. I don't think I'm going to compete again until maybe the Flow Duels in uh, where is that Lake Placid, and I'm trying to get a lot of freestyle competition in. Great. Well, good luck in the uh, in the semi school. Thank you very much. Thank you.